Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a topic that often confuses both tech enthusiasts and professionals alike. The key differences between workstation TPUs and gaming GPUs. If you're wondering which graphics card suits your needs, whether it's for intense gaming sessions or professional 3D rendering and design work, you've come to the right place. We'll break down how these two types of GPUs differ in architecture, performance, drivers, and price to help you make an informed decision. Let's get started. What is a workstation GPU? Workstation GPUs, also known as professional GPUs, are designed specifically for tasks that require high computational accuracy and stability. These GPUs are tailored for professionals working in industries like 3D modeling, CAD, computer-aided design, video editing, scientific simulations, and AI development. Unlike gaming GPUs, workstation cards focus on precision and reliability over raw frame rates. They handle large datasets and complex calculations that need to be exact, and they're optimized to work with professional software like Autodesk Maya, Adobe Premiere Pro, SolidWorks, or Blender. Still wasting money on ads that get ignored? Let influencers tell your story. Promotional Pack connects your e-com brand to the right niche influencer to reach your target audience. Get more sales with less spent. Link in description. What is a gaming GPU? Gaming GPUs are built primarily for speed and visual performance. They focus on delivering high frame rates, realistic graphics, and smooth gameplay experiences. These cards prioritize raw power to push modern games at high resolutions and detail settings. Gaming GPUs are optimized for DirectX and Vulkan APS, which are commonly used in the gaming industry. They're also more affordable and widely available for everyday consumers who want to enjoy PC gaming or streaming. Architecture and Hardware Differences While both workstation and gaming GPUs may share some hardware architecture, there are notable differences. Workstation GPUs often feature ECC, error-correcting code, memory to ensure data integrity during critical calculations. This reduces the chance of errors in scientific or financial computations. They also may have more VRAM, video memory, to handle huge data sets or complex 3D models. Gaming GPUs, on the other hand, focus on clock speeds and shader cores to deliver maximum frame rates. Their VRAM is optimized for textures and assets used in games but may not be as large or as error-protected as workstation GPUs. Driver Optimization and Software Support One of the biggest differences lies in driver optimization and software certification. Workstation GPUs come with specialized drivers certified by software vendors to guarantee compatibility and stability. These drivers are designed to work seamlessly with professional applications, ensuring fewer crashes, bugs, or glitches during important tasks. This certification process is crucial for industries where reliability is a must. Gaming GPUs have drivers optimized for the latest games and graphical features like ray tracing and DLSS. These drivers prioritize performance improvements and game-specific enhancements but aren't certified for professional software. So if you try to run professional applications on gaming GPUs, you might encounter compatibility issues or performance bottlenecks. Performance, gaming versus workstation. When it comes to raw power, gaming GPUs usually outperform workstation GPUs in terms of frame rates and real-time rendering. That's because gaming GPUs prioritize speed and graphical fidelity. However, workstation GPUs excel in tasks requiring double precision floating point calculations and enhanced compute performance, which are vital for scientific computations, simulations, and professional rendering. In simple terms, gaming GPUs deliver better performance for games, while workstation GPUs handle professional workloads with greater accuracy and stability. Price and Availability Workstation GPUs tend to be much more expensive than gaming GPUs. The premium comes from their specialized hardware, certified drivers, and guaranteed reliability. For instance, a high-end NVIDIA Quadro or AMD Radeon Pro card can cost multiple times more than a comparable gaming GPU like an NVIDIA GeForce RTX or AMD Radeon Arx card. This means if you're a gamer or a casual user, a gaming GPU offers better bang for your buck. But if you rely on your GPU for professional work where errors or crashes are costly, Investing in a workstation GPU is worthwhile. And that's a wrap on the key differences between workstation GPUs and gaming GPUs. 
Hopefully, this helps clear up which type of GPU fits your specific needs. If you found this video useful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more tech insights. Drop your questions or experiences in the comments below. I'd love to hear what GPU you're using and why. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.